cyber criminals are cheating people of NCR by using SIMs of North East region for cheating. When the cyber cell investigated the cases of cheating this year, it was found that in about 40% of the cases, the incidents of cheating have been carried out with the SIM cards of Assam, Arunachal Pradesh, Meghalaya, Tripura, Nagaland. By luring the vicious people with money, they are buying their IDs. Cyber criminals are cheating most of the North East SIMs by giving loans through Chinese apps and making profiles on social media by pretending to marry the youth. These gangs are targeting people by sitting in different areas of Delhi and surrounding areas. Apart from this, SIMs of Alwar and Junjunu, Mathura, Delhi of Rajasthan are being used in cases of KYC and fraud by posing as acquaintances. ACP Crime Bhaskar Verma says that in the investigation of the complaints received in the cyber cell, it has come to light that in about 40% of the cases SIMs of the people of the northeastern region have been used. The remaining cases are from different regions. These SIMs have been bought by luring people or taken in the name of using them for some other purpose. Taking advantage of not needing KYC, Many private banks do not require KYC for transactions up to 2 lakhs in savings accounts. This is also known to cyber criminals who are taking advantage of it. The vicious people are taking accounts by luring poor people with money in which they do transactions. If the account is closed by the police or the bank, then the vicious people start using another account. The swindled amount is being transferred to different bank accounts opened in the names of the people of West Bengal and Bihar. In the investigation of cyber cell, it was found that cyber criminals are opening accounts by taking documents from people by loading them with money or taking bank accounts on rent for 15 rupees to 20,000 after opening accounts from them. Many private banks do not require KYC for transactions up to 2 lakhs in savings accounts. This is also known to cyber criminals who are taking advantage of it. The vicious people are taking accounts by luring poor people with money in which they do transactions. If the account is closed by the police or the bank, then the vicious people start using another account.